On the morning of Sunday, June 25th, Orion Township hosted their second annual Kicking for a Cause kickball tournament at Friendship Park, benefiting Miracle Field. A total of six municipalities took part in the event, including Oxford, Bloomfield Township, Macomb Township, Springfield Township, and last year's champions, Rochester Hills. All six teams gathered at Miracle Field for the opening ceremony, then ventured out to the park's dirt diamonds for some fierce competition. In the first round, Orion faced Macomb and came away with a 6-3 loss. Oxford defeated Springfield 3-1, and Rochester Hills trounced Bloomfield 7-1. In round two, Orion defeated Springfield 5-2, Bloomfield destroyed Macomb 11-5, and Rochester Hills shut out Oxford 8-0. In the next round, Macomb defeated Oxford to face number one seed Rochester Hills, and Springfield moved past Orion to face number two seed Bloomfield. When the dust settled, defending champs Rochester Hills would face Springfield in the championship game at Miracle Field. Rochester Hills got on the scoreboard first with a sacrifice fly in the first inning to drive in a run. It was a defensive battle until the bottom of the fourth. With a runner on first, Nathan Mueller sends one over the left field fence to make the score 3-0 Rochester Hills. He had to be reminded to run the bases to make the score stand. Then in the bottom of the fifth, Firefighter Cody Moresh steps up to the plate with a run around first. He sends it deep to add two more runs to the Rochester Hills tally. In the bottom of the sixth, an error by the Springfield defense allows yet another run. Rochester Hills added two more runs in the sixth to make the score 8 0. Collision and just past second base. Bring it in. in the top of the seventh, Springfield had one last chance to avoid the shutout. The game ended on a pop fly, and Team Rochester Hills celebrates their second consecutive title. The team claimed the $5,000 first place purse to go to the charity of their choice, with Springfield walking away with $2,500. Brian, apparently last year was no flu. No, uh, man, we had a great, a great event out here. It was a lot of fun. First of all, you know, you're doing it for charity, so it's a lot of fun. And the highlight is still the, the game at noon with the, the Miracle League getting to cheer on the, uh, the champions and the athletes. But I got to tell you, our team was strong. I think we gave up two runs the entire day. Uh, and the defense was great, and just a lot of good people having a good time. Uh, we have no professionals, uh, as you might uh, as it might be rumored, but everyone just has a good time, and I'm really proud of our Rochester Hill squad for being back-to-back -back champions. Uh, what do you think the the winnings are going to go toward? Any idea? Yet? Yeah, I do. We just decided. Our captains decided. We had a, a team member that was out here playing last year, Sarah Rodiger whose husband, she's our planning director, whose husband passed away about a month and a half ago. They have a GoFundMe for their kids, and our team decided that we're going to donate our winnings to uh, our teammate Sarah's uh, uh, children for their GoFundMe campaign. So this is our second annual Kicking for a Cause uh, charity kickball tournament, and uh, we had six teams this year. Uh, we had a couple, couple last-minute cancellations, but we had an incredible day. We started early, and the excitement was in the air. The weather was perfect. Oh man, Orion Township did not come away with a trophy. We were training, we were practicing, but um, it was an awesome day. All, and at the end of the day, $8,000 of, of money is going out to charities in these different communities. It's, it's a great day. What did you end up raising for Miracle Field? Yes, yeah, so we, we raised um, this year about $3,000 will stay here with Miracle Field, and then the rest it lays as we thought. And again, we were hopeful that at least 5,000 more would stay here, but. Uh, but it'll go to one of the Rochester Hills charities. So it's uh, it's a great day to bring awareness. You know, we did the exhibition game with the Miracle Leaguers so people can see what this is really all about. But really, I like to have fun. And and uh, I thought when we first built this field, that was my dream. Like, I want to do kickball out here. And what a fun way to kind of do it with our rivals, but our colleagues around the region. So. The people coming out here today are absolutely incredible and wonderful and have the same goal of having fun and raising money for charity. And we couldn't be prouder of everyone who's out here participating. From Friendship Park in Orion Township, this is Joe Johnson reporting for ON TV News.